Hi guys, in this video I want to talk about four things that I learned after shaving my head. So let's get started. First and foremost, I experienced that nobody really cares about it outside of you, of course. So you know, I cut down my hair and yeah, your relatives and friends are gonna you know compliment it or say that by the fact that you shaved it, it looks ugly as fuck or they, they wouldn't even say anything, you know? That's one thing to keep in mind. The second thing is, it's hard to do it. Okay, you have like, I stand in front of the mirror and I go like, do you, do I want to do it? Really? Or am I insane? Why do I want to do it? You see, your brain, especially mine, are generating excuses. You shouldn't do it because it's summer, you don't, you are barking, so you should wait until you start cutting. All these excuses. What I did was, I just started. I grabbed the clipper, and I started, you know, from here, get the sides, the top and the rear, and that's it. Look in the mirror, this was what I was afraid of. I was really afraid of this for nothing. And yes, the answer is yes. Your brain is generating excuses all the time. Oh, you shouldn't go to the gym because you feel tired. I, I don't feel like it. There are too much people in the gym. There's no one in the gym. I don't have a training partner. All these excuses. My best advice is to just go for it. Have no regrets. The third one is it exposes your weak points. It highlights them. So you see, if you have a nice hair, then you can get away with a lot of things, especially with your other attributes. So you have 20% body fat. Many people are gonna say like, he's a good looking man. Okay, you get his hair, take it off, into the bin. Now, what does he have left? He's bald. He has 20% body fat, he haven't even heard about the gym or anything, he hasn't even done one push-up since high school. I shaved my hair and I looked in the mirror and said, okay, it's not that terrible, but I have a lot of things to improve. Okay, so I've been going to the gym for almost a year, so I don't feel that insecure, but I still have some things to improve. You know, my social skills, my English, my German, all of these things. Especially my, you know, focus. I speak too fast and this has, I think this is something inside here. The fourth and final thing is, for me, it, it light up a fire inside me. I got a burning desire to improve. So this is somehow connected. You know, the third and the fourth point is somewhat connected to each other. And for me, I got a feeling of you know, I was like, fuck, I look like shit. I either go to the gym and work out and go for the heavy bag out right there and, you know, just practice it. You either improve yourself or you are finished. There are no in-between. There's no like, oh, I kind of want to do this, but I don't feel like it. No, you either do it or you don't. If you have to do something, you should do something, then just go for it. Hesitation is your enemy. Discipline and focus is your friend. It is like your right hand. This is all for today's video. I hope that it gave you some kind of a value or entertainment, I don't know. I really want to like help you guys understand things that I have experienced so you can learn from my mistakes or I can show you some helpful things. You know, I just want to help other people just like me. Okay, I didn't have much resources and much help from other people, so I know that it is really a good thing to have someone who like tells you that, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna shave my head off, and what should I know? Okay, and for me, it was these four things. Okay, for another guy, it might be totally different. Okay, he is like a giga chat. He didn't have any regrets. He's is a ten out of ten man. Okay, so it's different for all of us. Find a thing that is good for you. Okay, thank you for watching. Hit the like button and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. See you next time.